Hallihallo, ihr Abenteuer Clownies und herzlich willkommen zurück zu Greedfall, wo wir das letzte Mal aufgehört haben. Bin ich nur ein Stück weiter gelaufen und durch den Wald und habe hier hinten den Lagerbereich noch mitgenommen. Und wir sollen ja immer noch zu der Mine ähm, und sind hier an einer kleinen Holzfällerhütte. Und wir müssen weiter reinlaufen in den Wald. Bis wir zu der verlorenen Mine kommen. Ich mach gleich nochmal die Karte auf, dann kann ich mal gucken, wo es war lang geht. Da hinten lang. Ich bin ein bisschen erkältet, es tut mir leid. So. Aber ich gebe mir die größte Mühe, euch nicht voll zu husten oder sonst was. So. Das nehmen wir alles mit. Das auch. Das auch. Du, 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 du. Den nehmen wir sowieso mit, den Kram. Und hier ist gleich nochmal ein Lager. Das nehmen wir auch mal direkt mit. Das fehlt uns jetzt nur noch eins hier. Hm. Die Coin Guard. Sorry, this is private property. I cannot allow you to enter. Actually, no one should be able to enter. This mine is doomed. It's terribly dangerous. I wouldn't know. Our employer, Mr. Mayard, is the owner. He's got all the deeds required. Listen, you should go to the authorities. They can confirm all the paperwork. I definitely will. Das heißt jetzt für mich... These people are reckless imbeciles if they start mining again in such a dangerous place. These Renegs, they must not have taken us seriously. We should take a closer look. Wucht der Aktivitäten in der, in der Mine. Wie soll ich da hinkommen? We should take the path that overlooks the outer wall. We should be able to see inside from there. Those reckless fools. They've resumed operations in the mine. The Monosinaida. They use captives from the villages to dig their mine. They've made them into slaves. We must talk to Sir de Corsillon. I hope that our nation is not involved in this business. Erklären Sie Sir de Consino die Lage. Kreisen. Hm. <lacht> So, das Wohnsitz, jawohl. Now we just have to go see the pretenders and hope that they will accept us. You are a metamorph. The natives will listen to you more carefully than they will listen to any other settlers. But you will still need to convince them that you are acting in good faith. If only there was a way to be certain of the results of this vote. We would only need to convince one. There is way more at stake in this election than your encounter with Enormi of Clifton. It will decide the fate of my people. And it may even... My dearest cousin, I am so glad to see you. You are right on time. We have visitors, and your advice would be most welcome. Let me introduce you to the emissaries of the Bridge Alliance and Teleme. Seeing them both in the same room is rather surprising, isn't it? But please, your excellencies, explain to us what brought you here. Sire, I have come to humbly request your help. We have been sustaining terrible attacks. Really? Are the natives behind this again? Unless it is those traitors of the guard. We aren't sure. 
but it is almost certain that the natives are involved. Governor Byrne is hoping that you could send him your cousin, as well as some troops. It would seem that we are in a similar situation, sire. Our city has been sustaining terribly violent assaults, and our losses are great. Our mother cardinal is begging you to send her some help as soon as possible. Oh, dear allies. Knowing that you are in such a delicate situation fills me with sorrow. However, the size of our troops has greatly reduced after the horrific attempt to Daku. Regarding sending my cousin, he's already very busy undertaking a mission of the utmost importance. Without even mentioning the fact that what you describe fills me with fear for his life, which is most precious to me. <sighs> no. I really don't see how I could be of assistance to you. Constantine. We cannot remain deaf to the call of our allies. I'm sure I can find time to go and evaluate the situation. I would love to accompany you, but my people are being wrongfully accused. I am certain of it, and I want to prove it. Very well, my dear. You know I cannot refuse you anything, but remember how urgent it is for this antidote to be found. We are so close to it now. Don't worry about it. You know how important this mission is to me. Well. This audience is coming to an end. Your Excellencies, inform your governors of my cousin's arrival. I hope that you realize how grateful you should be to him. Absolutely, sire. And we thank you both for receiving us. May the Enlightened always keep you in his divine blessing. <sighs> uh, I möchte aber mit den anderen Quatsch noch. Obergeschoss. The Sade, my young student. What can I do for you? The mission you entrusted me with has made great progress. Very well. Let's see. Good. You have traveled great distances. And the Terra Incognita will soon be but a distant memory. Keep doing what you're doing, De Sade. Can your old professor still prove himself useful? I found no traces of Professor Seraphedon yet. That's most regrettable. But keep looking for him, will you? You never know. Can your old professor still prove himself useful? I've come to ask you about a mine near Vigigador. It was closed for a long time for security reasons. But someone has started exploiting it again. Hmm. I seem to recall that a concession in this area was sold to a Master Mayard. However... I do not recall the details of the contract. It was established by the previous government. He is a rich merchant from Serene who arrived on the island only a short while before we did. People say that he is unscrupulous. <laughs> unscrupulous? That's an understatement. This man had some natives captured and he's using them as slaves to work in this mine. What? Does this old brigand really think that he is above the law? We cannot tolerate such methods, but we must determine the best way to attack him. You should start by finding the deed to his property in the archives. Don't worry, we'll not let this man's behavior go unpunished. Can your old professor still prove himself useful? Nee. Looking forward to seeing you again, Sir de Corsinio. Okay. Die sind hier unten, Untergeschoss. Minister, Your Excellency, it is always an honor. How may I serve you? 
That'll be all. Goodbye, Your Excellency. Ich dachte vielleicht, dass er die hat oder so, aber sieht nicht so aus. Sich noch weiter runter. Noch weiter runter. Oh. Das nehmen wir alles mit. Die Schriftdruck ist in den Reichs rechts Jargon verfasst. Es handelt sich um Besetzungen von Meister Milliard. Bezieht darunter eine alte Mine. Das Dokument wurde von Lady Morgan und I get lost in all the legal jargon, but they have Lady Moronja's seal on them. We should find her to understand exactly what they say. Hey, dear sir, happy to see you again in such fine health. How can I be of service? I need your advice once more. This time it's about the property deeds of a plot of land and of a mine acquired by a certain Mayard. Here are the deeds. I must admit that I understand very little of what's written, but your seal is on it. Hmm, do not worry. This type of document is always difficult to decipher for the uninitiated. However, they are very clear. Master Maillard is the owner of a plot of land located near the Yigador. He can exploit the forest and plant anything he wants there, but it says here that he does not have the right to exploit the mine. It's even repeated in this other paragraph. Any attempt at mining on this land is forbidden. And yet the mine which was located on this plot of land has been reopened and is being exploited as we speak. According to these documents, the mine has been closed for security reasons. This man's behavior is reckless. You should go see him. He's presently in New Serene. He usually spends time at the port when he comes. He has some warehouses there. Triff dich mit Meister Melliard. Okay. Come closer, good people. Master Mayard. Who's asking? The Sade. I am the legate of the congregation. Well, I'm flattered. What brings you here, Your Excellency? I'm here to talk to you about the mine you have near Big Yigador. Are you aware that you have no right to operate it? Nor are you allowed to employ slaves there. But what are you talking about? Surely this is a misunderstanding. Listen, I'm sure there is a way for us to get along. I'm an honest merchant. I've always paid all taxes and the small bonuses needed. Please tell your cousin that I would be happy to send him the gift of his choice. Now, Your Excellency, if you will allow me, I have to get back to my activities. I'm afraid you don't understand, Master. It's not a money problem. That mine is dangerous. And you endanger the congregation on this island by behaving this way with the natives. Come on, don't be so serious, young man. I'm sure it's nothing that a small bonus can't fix. Goodbye, sir. Best wishes to your cousin. Das ist ja nicht wahr. Das ist ja nicht wahr, der Typ, ey. Rotzfrech. Rotzfrech ist der.
Der denkt halt wirklich, dass er über den Gesetz steht. Der kann halt machen, was er will. That they forget basic decency, but it's high time we reminded him of who is in charge of the congregation on this island. Here, this is an eviction notice which dispossesses him of all his land for breaching his contract. For his crimes against the natives, he's banished from this island. I will make him aware of this decision, but you should go to the mine immediately. The prisoners must be freed as soon as possible, and the mine closed once more. I'll take care of it. Can your old professor still prove himself useful? No, thank you. Looking forward to seeing you again, Sir de Corsinio. Sehr schön. Können wir jetzt eigentlich die Mine schließen? Direkt. Und da holen wir uns jetzt schon mal den Schutz, äh, den, den, den Segen von Dings rein. Dumm krass. So. Dann reisen wir mal wieder zur Mine. Los ab. Sorry, this is private property. I cannot allow you to enter. I don't need your authorization. I have here an eviction notice signed by the governor's ministers. The former owner, Mr. Mayard, has lost his rights due to a breach of contract. Look, ultimately, we are not the ones who decide. We only obey the boss's orders. In that case, where can I find him to notify him of his loss? You'll find him around here somewhere, Your Excellency. Excellent. You looking for tr Master Mayard, I'm so glad to find you here. Here is a document from Sir de Corsillon on behalf of my cousin. Considering the fact that you have not respected the terms of your contract of ownership, you are hereby expelled. The methods you used against the islanders has also ensured your banishment from Tear D. Impossible. By what right? Guards, this man threatens me. I think I'm spinning. Ich glaube, ich spinne. Frechheit. These people were monsters. I wouldn't cry over them. Come now, let's go free my brothers, and we can tell Dunkers everything. Glaub es nicht. Go without fear. 
You are free. And know that we are sorry for what happened to you. We must believe that not only did Blow or Luik. He is an on all Manawi. That's why he understands us. Thank you. We will not forget you. <lacht> so, und die Mine wird jetzt hier geschlossen. Feierabend. Glaub's ja nicht. So. Statt der Dunkers Bericht. What brings you here on Al Manawi? I was able to close the mine. The man who operated it was arrested and he will be banished. Yes, those you freed told me. From now on, you are my Tarants, my friend. You knew how to renew my trust in your clan. Just as trees grow back after the <coughs> Thank you, Dunkers. I'm honored. Will you give us the old man now? If you allow it, I would like to punish him myself. Enough blood has been spilled, and he will only call for more of it, since he loved the forest to the point of killing for it. He will be sentenced to heal it. Every day he will replant what your men will cut down. Every day until the end of his life. Does this punishment seem acceptable to you? If I explain to Sir de Corsillon that the man was sentenced to forced labor, I suppose he will approve. Thank you, Dunkers. It's a wise sentence. Is there anything else? I would like to meet Enon Miel Frichtemann in order to find an antidote for the disease that is destroying my people. If you were elected, would you help me in this endeavor? You are a Karantz of our clan. And I have witnessed your wisdom and benevolence. I would be glad to help you meet Anon Mil Frichtemann. And I pray that he will help your people. But you should know that my election is far from certain. The spirits are divided, and some are thirsty for revenge. Would there be a way to make sure that you get picked? I do not like the idea of using such a method. But yes, there is a way. The High Kings of old wore a legendary crown, said to be a gift from Enon Mil Frichtemann. The one who became the first guardian is believed to have taken it with him in death. If someone were to wear it in these troubled times, they would definitely be chosen by the others. And where can I hope to find it? In the burial mound of the High Kings near the village of Vignamri. But it is said that the path towards it is strewn with spears, and that its entrance, situated near a large dead tree, is guarded by a Nardaig Magarman. It is a deeply holy place, and the Guardian will not let anyone enter without a fight. If you do decide to go there, fill your heart with humility and respect. For those who rest there were great men. Okay. So. Jetzt haben wir noch. Äh, uh, König Daira. Lüft dich mit. Ähm. Um Ja, komm. Wir hören uns mal an, was die wollen.
Also so sehr Verlust sehe ich ja nicht. Er sitzt immer noch da und vor den Nadaik. So, was willst du? Sir de Sade, seeing you is a genuine relief. Your emissary informed us that you were in need of our help. Indeed. She must have told you that we were being attacked. We are sustaining the relentless assaults of furious animals, which some people believe to be sent by the demons of the island. Some people? So you're not certain that's the case? We were mistaken when we thought them responsible for the Malikor. I became more cautious. But no matter where these attacks come from, our men are becoming exhausted. One of our outposts to the east has sent us a distress message. They won't hold much longer. I beg you, you must go to their aid. Maybe they can help you find out where these beasts come from. I will go there and meet them. I hope to make it in time. I am infinitely grateful, Your Excellency. You have proved your efficiency many times already. I am certain you will put an end to this. I must leave you. Naturally, Your Excellency. Hilf den Außenposten von San Mateus. So. Auf, auf. Mal gucken, ob was da abgeht. You shouldn't stay here. We're sustaining terrible attacks. The animals appear to be crazy. They already killed several of my soldiers. We are actually here to help you. Are you the backup? We were starting to lose hope. I must admit I was praying for more soldiers, but any help is welcome. We are under attack every night, and we've already lost a lot of men. At this rate, we won't survive another night. Don't worry. We will do everything in our power to make sure that you do. You still have some time to prepare before these beasts attack again. Or we could wait together until nightfall. All right, let's wait. Ready, weapons? Here they are! <laughs> Aber irgendwas stimmt mit denen nicht. Die sind dunkel. Also, die haben so einen Schleier. Irgendeinen Schleier haben die da drum. Oh boy. Come on. Let's see what you're capable of. Was?
glaub's ja nicht. Was seid ihr denn für Viecher? We, we have succeeded. Bravo, soldiers. We have resisted. Thank you, Excellency. Irgendwas stimmt mit den Tieren aber ganz und gar nicht. Das hat aber nichts mit den Ureinwohnern zu tun, denke ich. Ich denke, die Viecher kommen einfach nicht mehr klar, dass der Heike nicht tot ist. Und jetzt spinnt ähm, Olne Frick drin rum. Thanks for your help. You are an extraordinary fighter. If it were for you, the outpost would have undoubtedly fallen tonight. If these attacks are always this violent, even with our support, it won't hold much longer. We must uncover the origin of these attacks. I've thought about it, and I sent a few men two days ago in the hope that they would find out where the attacks came from, and first and foremost, why they are attacking. But I haven't heard from them since. I am afraid I might have sent them to their death. Could you at least tell me which way they went? I might be able to track them. They followed a trail going north of a place the natives call the Woods of Lightning. Thank you, officer. I will do everything in my power to find them. Until then, try to hold on. We'll be careful. Goodbye. Okay. So, dann bis zur nächsten Folge. Vielen Dank fürs Zuschauen.